Welcome back friends to your Tech Handy channel. Please like and subscribe to our channel and click the bell icon to get new video updates. If you are a VMware administrator and managing vCenter on a daily basis, you are probably fed up with the vSphere web browser security warning error and may also run into issues like downloading and uploading files to your data store using vCenter. In this video, I will demonstrate how to install vCenter server root certificate on a single device and how you can deploy the certificate to multiple machines using group policy to fix browser security warnings. From vCenter web browser. Right-click on Download Trusted Root CA Certificates and choose Save Link to download a zip folder containing certificates for different operating system architectures. For this video, we are only concerned to configure the Windows certificate. If you came across a network issue while downloading, close and open your browser again and give it another shot. Extract the downloaded folder. In the Certs folder, you will find multiple OS certificate folders. Select the appropriate certificate depending on your operating system, which in our case is Windows and we select the Win folder for that. Select the security certificate and copy it to one of your domain controllers. You can rename the certificate in the production environment for your ease, or if needs to work or share it with the Active Directory team. Once ready, open the Group Policy Management Console and select Servers OU where you want to deploy the certificate. I am deploying certificate policy on IT servers OU where the storage ICE CASI server resides because I am using the same storage server to access and manage the vCenter environment. But before deploying the certificate using the group policy, let me show you how you can install the certificate on a single device. Importing the certificate in the local certificate store is good for a single computer or two to three systems, but may be a tedious task if you want to maintain it on more than 10 systems, or maybe even more than that. Open the MMC console to add certificate snap-in. Make sure to open Certificate Snap-in for computer account. Expand the Certificate Tree and then Trusted Root Certificates Authority Certificates Path. Right-click Certificates, All Tasks, and then click on Import option. Browse the Certificate Path which you want to import and install. I will skip import since I want to deploy the certificate using group policy. Right click on your selected OU and select create a GPO in this domain and link it here option. Give it some new meaningful name and click OK. Right click on the newly created GPO and hit edit, this will open group policy management editor. Expand and select Computer Configuration, Policies, Windows Settings, Security Settings, and then Public Key Policies. Right-click Trusted Root Certification Authorities and then click Import. Follow the same steps from here, as demonstrated earlier to import the certificate for a single device.
If all is good, it shows friendly message the import was successful and new certificate will be visible for deployment. To force the policy, run gp update forward slash force command. Our certificate policy is now deployed successfully, and we can verify vCenter web page from the storage server where the policy is deployed. Close any existing open web page and relaunch your web browser again. As you can see vCenter server root certificate deployed successfully and there is no more browser security warnings. Thanks for watching. I hope you like this video. Please like, share and subscribe for more informative videos.